If you're looking for the East Empire Company, they've been gone for a Thanks. I wasn't sure I'd make it off this farm alive. I wish I could have said the same for my man here. Some of the Redoran Guard have taken to calling them Ash Spawn. Me, I don't care what they're called. All I know is they're a danger to Raven Rock and they need to be stopped. I was going to search for clues that might lead me to wherever they're coming from. I know it isn't the best place to start, but we know they've been coming from this direction. Good. I can use all the help I can get. Besides, I don't feel comfortable leaving Raven Rock behind, and I'd hate to lose any more Redoran Guard. We were searching the farm when the Aspawn ambushed us. Have a look around and see if you can turn up anything useful. This is strange. The note says it's from General Falk's Carius, but that's impossible. Well. Carius was the Imperial garrison commander at Fort Frostmouth, but he died over 200 years ago when the Red Mountain leveled the place. There's no way he could still be alive. If General Carius is still alive, there must be something keeping him that way. I need you to head out to Fort Frostmouth and check it out. I'm going to head back to Raven Rock and prepare the men for further assaults. No one knows, really. Superstitious folks say they're the risen forms of those that died long ago, but I'm not so certain. They started attacking the Bulwark a few weeks ago. My men were able to kill them, but they keep coming back. We've had two other assaults on the Bulwark, at different spots on the wall. I know it sounds crazy, but it's almost like they're becoming more organized and probing it for weaknesses. Exactly. Something has to be directing them against us. And we need to find out who, or what, it is. The Earthstone, and... Well, it's a shrine that... Uh, I can't recall. I don't know. It's hard to remember. Be careful. This General Curious sounds out of his mind. Men, an invader!
someone that now you're mine. over soon. Councillor Morvane is the what only... What news do you bring from Fort Frostmoth? I had my suspicions that he was undead. 
How else could he have survived for over 200 years? It's a shame. There are quite a few tales of General Curious' exploits, including the founding of Raven Rock. Councillor Morvane told me to give this to you if you made it back in one piece. And you got rid of General Curious. Better than a soldier's pay, so you should be thankful. It can be. Even the most experienced warriors can fall prey to petty distractions. They usually didn't amount to much, but they make my job that much harder. Some of my own men have become quite accustomed to a spirit they called Ember Brand Wine. Despise the stuff myself. It's powerful and tremendously addicting. I've seen men fail to finish even a single flask. If I knew where they were stashing the bottles, I'd put an end to it myself. You would? That would be helpful. I just don't have time to do it myself right now. Uh, they're too smart to have left it in the bulwark. I'd search one of the abandoned houses on the outskirts of town. Ah, this is bone mold armor. Quite impressive, wouldn't you say? It's fashioned from actual bone that's been reinforced with a resin-like material and then shaped to form the armor plating. It might appear brittle, but I'd wager it could stop the blow of a weapon better than iron or steel. All of the soldiers in this town are Redoran Guard. Some of the best warriors that House Redoran has to offer. I've spent quite a few years honing their skills, and I can assure you they're not just your average city guard. To protect Councillor Morvane, of course. He has quite a few friends on the council back in Morrowind, and they wanted to ensure his safety while he was here. Other than that, I'm not at liberty to discuss it. Find me that stash of wine. I'm itching to be rid of it.